Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to my channel for another good rank 25 only video where today is though guys I will be showing you how to obtain any race suit pants on any outfit after the patch of 1.39. Now if you don't know what the race suit pants are, it's basically the pants that you do get with the racing suits that did come in with uh, the kind of stunts DLC and you can basically get them on any outfit, any colour and anything like that guys. So I'll be showing you in today's one how to do it. It's basically using the directable glitch because we've been using the directable glitch on this channel a lot recently and I'm trying to get as many of these directable glitches out as I can but if you do enjoy these types of content and the directable glitch now for that then be sure to drop a like on today's video and subscribe if you to my channel as well guys because I would hate for you guys to miss out on any GTA 5 online content that I do post out in the future such as this and as always guys make sure you hit the notification bell if you're into my channel as well guys because uh, I'll notify you whenever I upload about GT5 video like this but anyway guys let's get straight into today's video so the first thing I do guys is we're going to go ahead and hop on your female character and we're going to go ahead and make the outfit make right now in the gameplay. For the pants and for that guys you want to go to the sports pants and you want to just find the pants that I do have right here in the gameplay. I will show you right now after this like what pants they are now for that um, because you will notice some and stuff for like that guys. So you go to sports pants and you will see here you can put on any one of them. I'm not really too sure like which one gives you which but you can try and experiment around with these uh, pants and for like that. I did say for like, the racing tops and for like that you can do the same. Experiment around with it and see what you can and make out of it but when you have made that for an outfit like that, guys go ahead and save as an outfit and hit start go over to online and hit swap character and swap to male character when you have swapped to male character guys you want to go ahead and swap to any story mode character then we have swapped to any story mode characters you would go ahead and launch out direct modes as i'm doing right now in the gameplay then when you have launched out direct mode guys all you want to do from here is you want to go ahead and go to actors you want to go to online characters and you want to go ahead and select your first gd5 online character which should be a male character as i'm doing right now in the gameplay so as you can see i just select my male character if you don't know what your male character is and your first slot and uh, then you can just check by hitting G to online one that should be your first slot there and G to online two is your second slot make sure your character is in the first slot and you want to go and walk around in the game for about 30 seconds as of right now in the gameplay when you have done this hit down the d-pad and return back to trailer by hitting the little trailer icon then we have done this all you want to do from here is you want to go to your profile you want to go to race activities i want to find one that looks a bit like this it can be your friends race activity guys it does not really matter and you can use a friends race activity as well guys it does not really matter as well guys but you need one to hit start G to online when you have found it, you want to hit start GT online. You will get two alert messages, guys. Go in and decline them both. And you want to go in and go to special characters. And you want to go in and select a special character called Jesse. And you want to go into the interaction menu thing. When you open up the interaction menu, you got five times on the D pad, then X, the number of 10, and X again. And what you should notice, guys, you can walk around the game after that. Then all you want to do for me, guys, you want to hit start, go over to online. And you want to select choose character. And then you want to select your female character when you are on the character selection screen, as I'm doing right now in the gameplay. When you have selected your female character, guys, you open the loan screen do not close your application or anything like that just wait in that loan screen until you get an alert message saying a uh, low key timed out session please turn the characters over 5 on um, story mode and when you do get an alert message guys make sure you hit x on it and return to story mode as normal as i'm doing right now in the gameplay then when you do load in story mode guys all you want to do from here is you want to go ahead and close your application and you want to reopen again and you want to go ahead and do the l1 r1 thing as i'm doing right now in the gameplay so just close your application and hold l1 r1 as soon as you get past the beginning you're going to up the two fingers um and when you do start grabbing over 5 as normal then when you are going through like the flashing lights rockstar logos now for that just hold l1 and r1 for all these little screens and now for that as i'm doing right now in the gameplay when you do this guys you will get display calibration go and confirm that by hitting next um as you can see here and then you will load in the story mode as normal from here guys all you want to do is you want to hit start go over to online and you're going to hit play g to online and go into the only session you will get a rockstar games online policy go and accept by hitting next and hitting the little box as well and then submit and then when you do load in a gta 5 online you should have the effort they did create on your female character and it's transferred now onto your male character. The outfit does look pretty cool and unique guys I can say so myself. The pants and for that here uh, do make the outfit pretty more now for that guys. If you do want to see some more more outfit tutorials guys then make sure you drop a like on today's video and subscribe if you to my channel as well guys because I hate if you guys miss out on any of these uh, GTA 5 online outfit glitches that I do post out in the future such as this. Um, let me know down in the comment section guys if you want to see more of this because I'm trying my best to get as many of these videos out as I can and I don't want you guys to miss out in the direct more glitch and I don't want to get in patched uh, so you guys don't miss out on all these outfits that I do create on my channel uh, make sure you hit the notification bell if you're into my channel as well guys but anyway guys I will see you guys in the next video peace and have a good day peace